So, but uh, we're kind of behind in this game for sure. Most people have already finished this game by now, but not me. I've been taking it slow and doing my best. Um, just trying to get stuff. I don't really know if I'm going to 100% the map. I don't know if I like the game enough. We'll see. Um, but we are going to be doing the dungeon today. Uh, I just want to get through like the main story stuff. So that way, uh, when I do like any of the overworld things, it will be, I guess, easier considering that we'll have all four people done. I don't know. We'll see. Um, but before we actually go to the dungeon, I'm still missing some geoglyphs that we have to watch. Um, there's two. I'm going to watch one right now and then one after the dungeon, probably. And then we'll have all the geoglyphs collected and then we'll start that little bit with uh, Impa. And then uh, we just got a lot of side quests to get through. I don't think I'm going to show all of them on stream. Um, just like probably the more relevant ones, I guess, to the main storyline. Um, oh, this is not where I wanted to be. Poor Link. Okay. Oop. I did mark the geoglyph. I did find it. I just marked where it was so that way... So that way we can just run, uh, fly on over. Okay, Link. It's been a month. How do you feel? I mean, I did do a little bit of stuff by myself, like off stream. But I was so discouraged by the fact that like my capture card wouldn't work and I hadn't streamed this game in a month and I haven't been doing the main story that like... <laughs> I didn't get really that much done. Okay, we're gonna get this geoglyph first. Um, what is that? Was oh, that the sun? Man, we're finally gonna get through at least a majority of the main story. Can't believe it. It's been like what three months since this game came out? That's kind of crazy. I'm definitely working this game at a slower pace than I did the first game, probably because I'm streaming, but also. I'm not as motivated to play this game as I was the first one. I don't know, it's just a me thing. I feel like every time I talk about this game, it's just me complaining. <laughs> so maybe I'm not the most fun person to listen to when we play <laughs> when uh, we play these games. But, you know, at least I, I have... I can say that I gave the game a shot, you know? I've put, like, almost 100 hours into this. I can say I, I gave the game a shot. Okay, let's, um... Look for little pond. Um, uh, my voice is also not already in the best condition because I went somewhere after work and I was using my voice a lot. Uh, so I need to drink a lot, a lot of water for this stream, probably. If there's gonna be some voice acting, oh god, why is this on this hill like this? Okay, oh, is that it? Found it already. Okay, sweet. Uh, there's a Korok somewhere around here. Maybe I'll find him if I feel like it. All right, but let's view this, um, this, uh, cutscene. Also, I just realized, is the game not detecting any sound? Hold on. The game is not detecting any sound, is it? There's sound on the capture card. How about... There we go. I thought, <laughs> this is not the world Geysard! Hello! Geysard! What's up? You're lurking! Thank you, thank you, I appreciate it! In the past. It's become legend. Geysard, I was practicing true. rapping earlier and I was thinking of you. <laughs> Your presence here is just as strange to us, Zelda. But if you, like Sonya, have a secret stone, and are able to manipulate time, and your story makes sense. Oh? I believed her right away. You needed the secret stone as proof, Raru? She's like, I'm better than you. I feel your light power within her, as well as my time power. Additionally, I sense that we share a blood connection. Ah, <sighs> uh, I see. Your ancestors. Zelda, you had said that you needed to return to your era as soon as you possibly could. But you're in the past, so it doesn't matter. In my time, something terrible is happening. 
I need to get back there. But how do I do that? I don't even know how I got here in the first place. <laughs> True sibling energy. Now, Zelda dear. Oh, you don't need to solve your problems all at once. Why not come back with us to the castle, hmm? No, I... We'll tell everyone that you're a distant relative of ours. Think they'll believe that? <laughs> The only thing that looks true, the all. same is the ears. We'll Evolution hasn't us. started yet. <laughs> I'm sure an answer will come to you. Wisdom takes time. Oh. I don't know what to say. Hmm, I wonder. Minoru, she may have some idea of how to get you back to your era. Minoru, you said? Yes. She knows far more than anyone about our people. And like us, my older sister has a secret stone. We'll call on her. Hmm. Okay. I feel like these memories barely give me any information. <laughs> I could watch them and I'd just be like, I still don't really know what's happening, but okay. <laughs> okay, uh, Nintendo. <laughs> Guess you won't really know all of the answers until the very end. Okay. Uh... Let us, without further ado... Go to the dungeon! And we will get this last geoglyph, uh... Um, afterwards. Um, I believe I'm supposed to go to Gerudo Town, I think? Because we already fought the Gibdos. We fought the Gibdos, so we should be good. Uh, I'm so ready. I wonder how long this dungeon's gonna take. I feel like the last one we did, the Grand Dungeon... Was it the Grand Dungeon? Yeah. The dungeon itself didn't feel as long as the other ones, but it was still long. So I guess we'll see. Um... B -b -b hey, ladies! Ladies! I've helped you. Where are they? <laughs> I've helped, and now we must discuss. That's someone there. Oh yeah, who's that? Who that? Am I allowed to take these, or is she gonna yell at me? Oh, she didn't yell at me. Oh, sweet. <laughs> I, guess, I guess they didn't know what it was for, so they're just keeping it there. I'm stocking up, or maybe the second I finish taking everything, then she's gonna yell at me. No, she ain't yelling at me yet. What are these? I guess I'll come back for these. I'm really expecting her to yell at me. I don't know why she isn't. <laughs> oh, it says saving. Now is she gonna yell at me? Ooh. Maybe it's the second I, I take the weapons too. But I mean, I don't have any room for them. Alright, anyways, um, I need to get back to the little underground area. Um, I'll talk to that lady later. Right now, main story is what's most important. Oh, hello, Riju. Oops, I'm coming to you guys from behind. <laughs> How very, uh, un... unflattering. <laughs> Look, Link. There's a Gibdo hive, just like the one that appeared near Karakara Bazaar. Hmm. Both the hive and those tornadoes were reported to have shown up at the same time, too. But it's not only the one hive. There are three to deal with, each just outside the town gates. I don't need a clairvoyant sand seal to know a massive Gibdo attack is coming. Oh. Right now, those hives are durable and nearly impervious to attack. But when they open and begin releasing Gibdos, they're vulnerable. The Gibdos won't wait in outside our walls forever. So when they launch their attack, that's our chance to strike. Oh, we get to do this three times. Interesting. Uh. A voice in my head. Huh. It speaks to me. Huh. You 
where I am. Again, you heard it, didn't you? Yes? Come, is it calling out to us? You know, Lake, why can't you just explain? We've done this so many times before. Well, I guess technically we can't because not everything's in chronological order. Lady Riju, Link, is something the matter. I thought... It's nothing. Link, for now, we should focus on protecting Gerudo Town from the enemies at our gates. We must prepare for battle. Okay, we get the whole army. Riju of Gerudo Town. God, there's like no music playing. It's so quiet. It's like, it feels like a dead town. The sand shroud, the sudden appearance of the Gibdos in their hives. Strange events keep happening, one after another. And we saw Zelda near Karakar Bazaar, but she hasn't been seen anywhere around Gerudo Town. There's something bigger going on, but for now, we need to focus on the problem at hand and prepare to fight. Link, I need your help again. Speak with Boliera and the soldiers and help us organize our defenses. Oh, now this might take a while. Um, tell me the plan. I don't think you need to tell me about the enemies. It's just Gibdos. We know how that works. Oh. Talk to Captain Tiak in the yard. Work with her to decide how best to deploy our forces. Oh. Para is, at the, is in the courtyard. She's in charge of the materials we have on hand. We could reinforce our defenses with them. If you need anything, you should talk to her. Do you have questions about preparing for the battle? Prep- yeah, preparing. Um... Fire, lightning, yeah, okay. I already knew that little bit. So now we just talk to everybody. Alright guys, let's raise our army with the little people we have. Hello. Hives of monsters have appeared outside the town walls. It won't be long before we'll need to deal with this threat. How should we deploy our forces? Who should we send and where? We could spread them out to lightly cover all the gates, or maybe a concentrated force to protect a weakened position. Huh. We need to decide who to send where. I'd like to hear your thoughts. In before Capture Card fails recording is corrupted. I would be so mad. I almost like gave up on trying to stream this again. But I feel like I should at least get through uh, the main story, even if I don't complete all of the side content. <laughs> But hello, food. What is up? And uh, it's also probably because I'm streaming on a Thursday, which I don't normally stream on. That it's like a weird time for a lot of people. Um, let's see. Uh, who do we send? Uh. Oh. Let me read this again. Oh shoot. Um, we'll go with spear. Wait, is there a correct answer to this? <laughs> I have no idea. Okay. Uh. It will defend the north gate. I feel like it shouldn't matter. Uh. This game is way too easy. It probably shouldn't matter. I guess I'll just put him here. But how has your day been, food? I have a really crazy story to tell. <laughs> um, cannoneers. Eastgate? Yeah. Uh. Mm, this looks about right. It's right in front of it. Uh, <laughs> I have no idea. Okay, Let, we're, we're gonna hope for the best. We're, we're gonna play and hope for the best. <laughs> that That's the plan. I'm not peeking, am I? No, I think I'm good. Hello, Pada. Uh. I've been gathering materials that I think might be useful in battle. Feel free to take anything you need from here. Oh, that's why she didn't yell at me when I was just grabbing random shit earlier. Also, I'm confident that I can build a barricade of, at any of the gates. Would that help you? Uh, sure. Ooh. Okay. Uh, probably the east gate, because I think that's where I set up the cannons, right? So probably barricade that area. Because me melee won't be doing good there. Ah. Okay, the barricade has been set up at the east gate. That should slow down any enemies that attack that position. My god, how is this gonna work? 
Okay, I'll keep it at the east gate. Um. Okay, this is an interesting concept. But I feel like Nintendo wouldn't make it in a way where your choices really matter. So, we'll see. Are the preparations complete? They are. Okay, let's hope. Let's hope for the best. Game has been black. <laughs> I pulled up. <laughs> I pulled up my my stream on my phone to make sure everything was working, and I got a One Piece ad. <laughs> Everyone looks so short in this game. Uh, is this voice acted? I can't hear. No, it's not. Okay. I'm curious about that voice we heard earlier, bud. Never down Nintendo, they have never missed once. <laughs> Big fat lie. Big fat lie. We all know that. Situation report. Large numbers of Gibdos are moving to attack the town. Before anything else, we'll need to deal with this. <laughs> Ooh, look at it pulsating. Well, oh, there's a lot of them. Okay. Um, I don't know where how this is gonna work. Am I just gonna have to <laughs> I'm just gonna run out there? I'm gonna be doing probably all of the work. Liera, they have the town surrounded. Stay strong. Oh, that was a very weak stay strong on my end. Sorry. This threat is also an opportunity. Fight well and we can wipe them out in one battle. Hives and all. I feel like this is not gonna be that hard. Prepare yourselves for battle. Let's show them the true power of the Gerudo. Ooh. Everyone, protect our chief, protect our town. Okay, I will just go for it, I guess. Monsters have appeared outside town. Shore up the defenses at the gate. Okay. I will start... Uh, sheesh, okay. Enemies have emerged from the hive at the east gate. How do I get out of here? Um... <laughs> We're off to a very amazing start. Where are you, Riju? Okay, we already got some... Uh, okay. I don't have an electric weapon on me, but that's okay. I have this, but this might break soon. I'm just gonna be switching between, like, these things. So that way I don't, uh... Or actually, can I just, like, toss? Um... Are pouring in near the north gate? Is this not the north gate? Okay, I'm trying to throw something, but it's not working. Ayo. Nice, okay. Oh my god, there's a shooting star! Did the Gibdo bone I was using on here bro break? It did! What the heck? Okay. Oh, I forgot. I freaking read you. What am I doing? Okay. Um, I think they can handle these guys. Let's check um over here. Looks like they got a situation over here. Uh, da -da 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 -da. running, 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 running. Oh, sheesh. Yeah, that's a lot. Okay, I'm helping. Flying enemies. Okay. Um, how do I use her power again? I'm not gonna lie. I really, really don't remember. Oh, I use arrows. What the. F did they shoot me? Where are they? Did they break the hey! Whoa, where is that coming from? Oh, it's up there. Ew! What is that? <laughs> okay, read you, please. Sweet, okay. Oh, cool, we took that hive down. I guess I could just leave it to these guys. Okay. <laughs> is this gonna be sweaty? Probably not. Okay. Need a help out over here. Oh, yeah, they've infiltrated. Whoa! Okay, at least Riju's okay. Uh, oop. Uh, flying enemies. I probably have to take care of those, though. Okay. This is not that bad. <laughs> Man! 
Oh. Okay. I can never tell when Riju's thing is charged. All right, let's help out uh, this gate. We haven't been over here yet. Ayo! God, Link, you're so slow. Because we don't have any... <laughs> we don't have any sand stuff. Okay, whoa. Yeah, I should probably be worried about this side. I know! I'm coming! Wait. Oh, God. Okay, wait. Where the heck is she? Oh, she's over there. Okay. Um, we definitely need to take care of these guys, however, first. Okay. Riju, where are you? Ugh, I can't... She's, like, all the way on the other side. Okay. Um, I'm gonna worry about getting rid of this hive. Uh, okay. Where is Riju? Oh, it says there's still another nest. Oh, wait, it didn't get destroyed. Okay, sweet. Okay, I wish... Uh, oh, there's one of these guys in here. Where is he? Oh, it's a flying one. Oh, that's why Riju's under attack. Oh, okay. Okay, okay, okay. Whoa. Ew. 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 <laughs> Ew. <laughs> Did you see the way they were crawling on the floor? Oh my god. Okay, that wasn't that... <laughs> that was kind of lame. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. It's kind of lame. Yay! Fighting! Combat! Let's go! Link, I am incredibly grateful for your help in the battle. On behalf of all the Gerudo, thank you. I suspect the Gibda threat will calm down a bit now that we've wiped out the hives that were surrounding the town. I noticed that the hives crumbled into sand when we destroyed them. I wonder if the Gibdos have some kind of connection to the sand. Or maybe... Maybe they're connected to the sand shroud. Did they make it? Did it summon them? Hmm. hmm. And then there's the voice that you and I both heard. A voice in lightning. This reminds me of something. Hmm. Link, there's something you should see. Come down to the mural in the underground shelter. Oh, hey, food, are you still here? <laughs> you... The last time I streamed this game, like a month ago, there was a little... set... a... Uh, section where I feel like you would have appreciated. <laughs> we got some hands-on... um... how to seduce a man... Uh, experience. <laughs> it was crazy. Alright, let me just collect all these things. Gibda wings. Hey, we're gonna find another flying Gibda. Okay, uh, where am I heading to now? Oh, back here. Must I... Must I speak to you again? Or... Oh, this way. This way, this way. Okay. Oh, is that where the temple is? Way, way out there? Oh, underneath. Uh, I wish that these little little guide marks would tell you <laughs> what layer of ground to be under. Okay. Heading back. Hey, let me through, ladies. I'm an important man here. Uh, for a second, I thought they weren't going to open it. I was about to be like, really? Really? Um, uh, I don't... I'll deal with that lady later. I think I have a slate to show her, but now I know. Grab City, welcome! Hello! Finally getting this game to work, huh? <laughs> Hello, Riju. Oh, Link, you came. Look at the mirror on this wall. Finally, I know! This game was giving me such sh shit for so long. <laughs> Beat the game and all. Yeah, I've been taking it slow. I don't know how much of the side content I'm gonna end up doing, but we'll see. I even had mic problems right before stream, too. How lucky. 
It is thought to have been painted by ancestors of the Gerudo. It appears that when they created it, they were also using the shelter to hide. Perhaps the Gerudo of the distant past were also beset by some great disaster. Not long you've been having issues. I might restart again. Yeah, a whole <laughs> long time. Crazy. I, I, f I felt like the universe just didn't want me to play this game. <laughs> Perhaps the Gerudo of the distant past were also... Oh wait, I read that. Right? Anyway, the writing on the mural says, Standing back to back with the throne, witness red pillars across the vast sea. Unite the pillars in light to reveal the lightning stone and open the way. You who can hear my voice, come to me. I await you. That mysterious voice that spoke to us. Its words reminded me of this mural. This image must represent a location of some kind. And the engraved words are riddle in to discovering its location. Well, good thing you're here, Gramzi, and you can just tell me where it is. <laughs> Listening in background, did you have stream issues again? At the very start. Uh, my microphone wouldn't connect. I had to freaking troubleshoot my laptop. Uh, so I started like 15 minutes late. So <laughs> we'll see, honestly. Um, where, what is Izo now? Uh, wherever Riju is about to say. <laughs> it's the only explanation that makes sense. Okay. Red pillars and light. The writing... Uh... Sound show is possible, except maybe if you could soar in the sky like a retail. Okay. Uh, they're asking me to go to retail village? Or... Go, like, on the tower? And see? Let's see, let's go to this tower and like launch ourselves up in the air and, and we'll see. Two pillars, like a vast sea. Two red pillars. Um. Okay. Well, I'll, we'll look, we'll look. We'll fly super high and we'll see. Two pillars. Is that one pillar right there? Oh, there's a constellation. Or not constellation. A meteorite star. Is that a pillar? No, just tell me right away. Let's not waste time. Let's not waste time. Tell me right away. <laughs> uh, okay. Because if someone doesn't tell me, I'm going to look it up. <laughs> I'm going to do what all gamers hate when you look up stuff. Mm. Behind the village. Okie doke. Uh, let me... Let me just grab that, uh... Shooting fallen star while we're at... Over here. Sun's about to rise! Wait, that means this will go away! <gasps> I need to pick it up quick. Oh, is that a... Is that a shrine over there? Oh, it's really dif difficult to navigate? Oh shit, okay. Uh, we'll get this shrine. Have I even gotten this shrine? I don't think I have. Okay, let's see. So I have to... So we initially have to navigate through the... Through the sand shrine is what you're saying. Gosh, how... Why would they think that's a good idea? No one wants to do that. Okay. <coughs> Sorry. Okay. Star? Hey, what was that? Oh, it's just Liz off us. No worries. Not a big deal. So I just suggest you use the walkthrough because I kind of guess my way. Mm, something that I've been doing is like, if I need to navigate through something, I'll put like a little, like one of these little beacons and then I'll be, and then I'll use like the depths map. So that way when I'm in the sand shroud, I can technically still see where this is. Like, I mean, it won't tell me my location, but I'll know that this is, like, on the map. So, that's been kind of helping a little bit. Hmm. I guess... <laughs> okay, as long as I know it's behind the village, we can at least get an idea. Um... I'll just grab that. We won't do it, um... Just yet. Okay. 
So behind the village, so somewhere here. Let me go back here. Let, let, let's take one more, one more look in the sky. See if we can find what the, what the clue is and then we'll head, head on over and see. And try and navigate. And try our best to navigate if we can. <laughs> oh boy. And, and on top of this, the dungeon's probably gonna be super long. Okay. Link, get yourself up into the sky. I think I might have to sit here and wait till nighttime because I don't have any, um... Heat resistance clothing. Okay. Um, here. Um... So that's the town. I can't really see anything, though. From this far away. It, was the game, like, expecting me to shoot myself up into the sky with, like, a... Oh, the top of the village? Okie doke. Uh, we'll look. Like, with, I was gonna say, were they expecting me to, like, uh... Um, what is it called? Use the campfire and, like, shoot myself up in the air with pine cones? <laughs> We'll look, we'll look. I'll spend like maybe five minutes searching it on my own before I'm like, Google! <laughs> oh. oh, I have four blessings. Is that what it's called? I got another heart. Um, okay. Oh, these things. These pillars? <laughs> Sorry, I'm yawning. Standing back to back of the throne, witness rare pillars across vast sea. Unite the pillars in light. So light, does it mean like... This? Ah, Link! You ruined a perfectly good, what would have been a nice air dive. Okay, well I marked... Oh wait, am I supposed to mark both of them? Whoops. <laughs> Let's redo that. <laughs> Let's, let's, uh, let's... <laughs> so much going back and forth. Man, don't we love the fact that the Switch has such short loading times? Isn't it crazy? <laughs> okay. We'll mark these two. The pillars themselves. And I marked the middle. Why not? Okay, we'll switch our map to down below. That way we'll still be able to see them. Dun 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 dun. Alright. Come on, Sand Shroud. Go for it. Oh. I guess the Sand Shroud is clearing a little bit? Okay, sweet. Dude, thank goodness for a sad. You know what's funny? I started playing Genshin again because uh, Fontan came out and <laughs> I keep forgetting that Genshin doesn't have like the blast forward or the ascension thing and I keep like <laughs> wanting to um, wanting to uh, <laughs> use it but it's like wait it's not a thing in this game. I want to blow myself up. Oh! Wait, okay. Alright, cool, cool, cool. And just walk this way. Get my marked pins. It says the green one I marked is over here. Oh wait, was I supposed to... Was I supposed to adjust the light? Is that possible? Can I do that? Let's check. Oh, follow the light? Okay. Ew! Stupid Gibdos. Ew! Nasty. Okay. Run, 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 run. Do these Gibdos stay even after we finish the fight? Probably, right? Not the fight, the dungeon. These guys are slow as heck. 
You know, I was always wondering, I was like, should I fly up with those sand things or will they just completely encase me? I never knew, I could never tell, and I never attempted. <laughs> but now that I've learned from you, that, uh, that I can. But I didn't want to take that chance. Okay, gliding isn't always faster. Yeah, those Gibda bones are strong as heck. They're great. Ah, uh, heat. I don't have the clothes. I only have this, but it's not enough. Well, it'll be enough for now, but not eat. As it gets more in the day, it'll be hotter. Excuse <laughs> me, Gibdos. Not gonna waste any of my materials here. Okay, here's a pillar. Okay. This thing... This is the middle one, I assume. This is the middle pillar. This is the one where I have to meet them in the middle with. Okay. Oh wait, that is the pillar? Oh, it's hot. I did not make food. Okay, gotta... Let's cook real quick. <laughs> Where can I buy the clothes that I need for this? Haven't looked. Okay, let's, uh, cool, cool, cool sandwiches. Okay, and we're gonna munch munch. Okay, uh, da 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 so this is not the meat in the middle. This is like the pillar pillar. Okay, the only question is, where does its other source of light come from? Sun? This is a side thing the lady said when you bought the head thing. Side thing? Oh, it's a side quest. Okay. I guess I'll have to look at that after. I don't see anything. Other than just freaking gibdos. Whoa! Oh my god, I'm so like... <laughs> I haven't played in so long, I can't remember the controls. Okay. Do I have an arrow inside of him? He does. <laughs> Alright, come on. Come at me. You keep my arrow so I'm not losing him. That's great. Oh, hello, Sidon. Okay, is this really where I'm supposed to be? Hmm. Oh, I don't think this is it. Maybe I should keep following it. Um. Let's see. I feel like. Hold on, there's like so much fog here. I should probably. Use the shroud. Hmm. Dun 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 Okay. Yo! Oh, we can see the light now. <laughs> okay, this way. The other pillar. Now we've been encased again. I'm gonna run out of stamina. Maybe I shouldn't have ran towards the shroud. Oh wait, stopped. Oh, over here. 